up guys welcome back I guess now as you all saw like I played both episodes by now of my first attempt at Algeria because I won't hide my losses I mean that's my second match in a game I try to get my best and I, I got killed immediately it happens Sam so, yeah, we're gonna try to do this again all right and try to hopefully get a better start because you know this stuff happens you'll probably lose immediately i just wish that the guy could have left his entitlement out a little bit is all hmm it is tempting as hell but who wants to play that's boring though bro who wants who here really wants to take that Oh, Ron. Wait. Oh, this is also Spain. Okay. So, Tunisia, Egypt. I mean, I could easily grab Algeria and say, oh, guys, nah, 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 that, that's too much. Huh. Let's go for. Hmm. I don't know. I, I mean, I'm kind of intrigued in this, though. And all that. So, let's see here. Let's let's let it pick randomly. We let the game decide for us. Cause I don't know. Italy. Okay. All right. Let's let's immediately go on our research though. All right. So we're gonna research infantry. I want to go for, yeah, let's just keep a normal infantry. And then I'll also do artillery. Just like last time, right? Eastern Slavs? That's Ukraine, right? Yeah, that is too far away. So, now, if I can make a coalition pass, I should be great here, okay? Create a new flag, I. Right. Yeah, let's do the lion. Let's have it be like that, and then... Yeah, save. I. It's not the Baltics. Hmm. I mean, there's stuff I could say. But... Hmm. The rising lions. Where is it? To the Asian to win. I. Huh. Wow. So it looks like us and Germany have a little bit of different plans, but it happens though. So now we're going to want to build some barracks and all that, of course. So yeah, I'm just sad that the other series fell through in two days, though. Like, I know it was saying it was too, but it's always sad to see that happen. But yeah. So yeah, this is like my third match on Call of War. Uh, one loss and one victory under my belt. So anyway, I didn't check. What, um... Doctrine are we fighting under that now? The Axis Doctrine. So we get increased unit damage and hit points, but they cost more. Alright. So let's see here. Also, oh, Italy doesn't have a city down here. Interesting. Okay. So it's Cyprus. I think it's all the way over here, right? But this is before the conflict with Turkey, I believe. So with us here. Uh, peace, peace, info. Hmm. Okay. So let's do neighbors. We only want... So these are all our neighbors. Only Soviet ones, Yugoslavia. Alright. I want to push into Sweden. Fight a squadron. I mean, this is... 
I don't think this is the bomber, is it? Yeah, it's the A251. I was just trying to think of a name. I haven't seen this in a little bit. Alright. How much does it do against unarmed? I mean, it does a little bit. Rather than nothing, though. That's for sure. Yes. Fight them. So, yeah. Uh, hmm. I mean, I think about correctly, you can deport from land without needing a city, right? Yeah. The conflict's the only one that requires such a thing. I just kind of want to take, like, only stuff in the middle of my provinces. Yeah. Yeah, for this, we can spare the armored car, too, while we're at it. I mean, yeah. We should be able to win it. Man, this is some good music, though. Yeah, we'll get try to get some infantry set up and all of that in this. So that's an AA gun. I thought that was too little infantry. Coming down here, we can bring up... I mean, Tenet can bring up this guy. Yeah, let's do that. Bring him up here. So yeah, let's hope that this series goes better than the last one, though. Since that J1 is a bust and all of that. But yeah. It is what it is, you know? So yeah, we're just gonna get set up here, have a grand old time and all that. So as guys, I hope you'll have a great time watching this match, admittedly. Cause I don't know how it's gonna go. So yeah. Oh Wiki. Probably a different page, right? Oh wow. Set in the Second World War featuring May history and in serious scenarios. Okay. Alright. Oh yeah, because I forgot, doesn't this like end within a month or so? I forgot. But yeah. I mean look at me, I'm considered level 34 yet, yeah, this is only my third ever match. Oh, this one's on your country, yeah. So I'm actually kind of a little bit further down this line, but yeah, I kind of want to get to the general armies though, if possible, but that would take like months of playing this game. But yeah, here's a lot of players so far. So we got Yugoslavian, a German, a France, United Kingdom, a Polish, a Turkish, a Caucasus, Ukrainian. And different Russian ones. So what, Russian Empire so many nobles, right? Or well technically that's I don't know what I'm thinking of. So they're not Oh no, they are commie. I don't know why it says commie in turn. I, mean, I can see why though. Yeah, this is the old Russian, this is the new Russia, essentially. What's the USSR actually? So that's what I find weird. If this is set in World War II, I think they were called the USSR by then. Or not yet, actually. I don't know. I mean, it's been a while since I brushed up on my history, is all. But I do know that all of this was part of... Russia. But yeah, either way. Guys. That is... So, wait. I'm looking at the flags? Probably is USSR. I mean, this is USSR flag as I know it. A little bit different though. But yeah, most of these have like their more modern flags though. Because I know, like, okay, that's Spain's flag from back then. It's Germany's. But I know some of these weren't actually these flags. You know? Either way, that is going to be it for this one, y'all. I hope you'll have a good one. Good night, good day. Bye.